Welcome back. We start the night with the Marketplace Chevy Player of the Week, and it goes to a young man who found the end zone six times in Friday's win over Arkansas High. Texas High quarterback Colton Clack is this week's Player of the Week. Jory Perry's, pre Jory Perry's presented him with his trophy this afternoon. I am here now with Texas High quarterback Colton Clack, our Player of the Week. Congratulations. I'm going to hand that to you again for his performance against Arkansas High. Now, 275 yards, four touchdowns in the air, two more on the ground out of over 80 different high schools in our area. You were the very best this week. What's it mean to be holding that trophy? Uh, it means a lot. I just thank all my teammates, my receivers, and my O line. It was a crazy game on Friday. You know, Arkansas got high, had the lead at the half. You guys came out, scored that touchdown right away in the third quarter. How does that prove just how capable this team is this season? Um, if we just execute and play with great effort and play the best of our ability, I mean, there's no ceiling. Visiting you here right after practice, what are you doing on the practice field to try to have that same sort of production every week? Well, we just try to play every snap like just in a game-like situation, just play with great effort. Was there anything from Friday night that you're going to really remember being the arch rival? Oh, yeah. I mean, we'll, I'll probably tell my kids about it someday, just being the big rivalry. There you go. Well, Colton, congratulations again. Thank you so much for your time. We look forward to seeing you this season. Thank you. All right, we're going to send it back to you in the studio. Thanks, Jory. Also, a big thanks to Bud's Trophy Case in Bossier City for supplying this year's Player of the Week and Player of the Year trophies. Colton Clack will now be added to the, play, the Player of the Year ballot at the end of the regular season. Clack and the Texas High Tigers back at it this Friday night when they go on the road to take on Liberty Ilo at Harris Field. Kickoff set for 730.